I'm Corey Carmichael with the Memphis Tiger Network here at the El Marone Fieldhouse where the Tigers won a nail biter in overtime defeating ETSU 77-74. Three Tigers scored in double digits to secure the season opening victory. Both teams battled back and forth in the first half and the score was tied at 29 going into the break. Memphis mounted a 9-0 run that gave the Tigers a 7 point lead with 9 minutes left in the half. The bench scored 16 for Memphis, including 8 from freshman Taylor Williams. The second half was another hard-fought half. Three Tigers scored in double-digit points in regulation. Asana Hope, Asiana Fuqua Bay, and Mariah Rouser, who played for the first time since injuring her knee in the third game of last season. With a score tied at 67, Memphis had a chance to win it with five seconds left, but the missed shot sent it into overtime. The Tigers outscored ETSU 10-7 in overtime. The team forced 10 steals throughout the game and also shot 41%. Mariah Rouser led the team in her return appearance with 15 points. Good, and I'll tell you what, I was really pleased with our team. I thought we got a little bit flat emotionally, but we didn't ever fracture. You know, I could still see good energy amongst our teammates on the court. Um, we made a lot of mistakes tonight, um, but I, I, I was really pleased because I thought when push came to shove, we made the plays that we had to play, had, that we had to make to win the game. But like I said, it wasn't pretty. I mean, we made enough mistakes for both teams out there today. Um, and, and a young point guard late in the game, playing a tough, um, a tough first game, her first game of her college career. Um, she made a couple offensive mistakes, but I thought Bria Cochran was really, really great down the stretch defensively. And uh, it, it was a true team win. I mean, I, I thought Sana was really good tonight, particularly on the boards. I thought Mariah hit some really critical shots in the second half. Um, Ariel was a little bit subpar. I think the foul trouble early really bothered her, and she's got to learn how to manage that a little bit better. I thought Taylor Williams got us off to a really good start. So we're young. We are going to be maddening at times, but we hung in there. We hung in there and just kept chipping away at it. Uh, in this game, we came out, we knew what we had to do. Concerning last year was, it was tough on the road. So we knew we had a great chance to beat them this year. It was a home game, it was our first game. We came out excited with a lot of energy, so that was big for us. 